we've been getting better day in day out and uh main thing we just got to stay consistent and uh our room kind of been consistent with uh, me terrence daryl and leonard and uh that, that's just the main thing to stay consistent t mcgee had some uh, high praise during media days of uh, leonard fournette what have you seen from him the first few days of his college oh, experience? Man, uh, I mean y'all, I mean y'all know, you know, so he's a great back and uh he come in to get a little speed outside. He can run in between the tackles and uh we're gonna need all four of us to uh, contribute to this team. And so uh he's just been getting better day in and day out and we have been motivating him uh, as a freshman to just stay on top of his game and uh other other than that, we good. So upperclassmen, do you kinda have to set that tone of unselfishness like hey we're all going to get our carries and, and we're going to get ours i mean it, it's just been that way in this program uh we need all our backs to play a big role and um man terrence has been doing a great job of just motivating the young guys to uh hey man just come out and give you all and uh, hold on to the ball kenny what does he have to learn quickly leonard going from being a high school star like you were to being a college player what are the big differences that he's going to uh, face uh, main thing i just uh, feel like you know, just staying consistent. You know, that's just the main thing in our offense. Uh, just coming out, giving it all, all day in and day out, and uh, holding on to the ball, and uh, you know, reading the progression, picking up blocks. And uh, other than that, he will be fine. And uh, that's what we've been doing. He's been coming out, giving it, giving it his all. Him and Daryl, and uh, he's been looking great. What do you envision your role being in this group? Uh, my role is, I mean, anything they want me to play. Uh, and so, if, if it's full back, half back, uh, sometimes spread out and a shotgun and uh, do what they ask and I'm going to do it. Is that what you thought when you decided to come back for this year that you would have kind of a flexible role like that? I mean, my main thing was to come back and get my degree. And uh, since I was six hours away from it, so hey, why not finish it? So I know, uh, you know, this is just a short term and so the degree will last forever. So mainly, uh, I know I haven't been progressing over the years. So yeah, I mean, I wanted to come back and finish my senior year and, and do great. Would you, you think you'd be taking some of those J.C. Copeland responsibilities or picking up some of that slack? Uh, left no. Line? no, sir. I mean, we have we have a stable of fullbacks that uh, that came in as walk-ons that that did trans uh, transmitted from uh, linebacker to fullback. So, I mean, I'm not really taking those roles. I'm gonna leave that to Connor Neighbors and uh, Melvin Jones. When you look back over your career so far, what are some things that you? feel like you're proud of in terms of your contribution to the program? Uh, I mean, just coming in day in and giving it my all. Uh, if it's contributed to play fullback and running back, uh, I, I feel like I'm, I'm happy with, you know, coming back and uh, and try to win a national championship for these guys and uh, getting my degree for my family. And uh, that's what I'm most proud about myself. I'm almost finished. I'm going to be the only uh, son that get a degree.